Well, you know what? I will say overall, as a competitor, I'm very impressed by the man who now wants to only be known as Jackson, not even by his original name. But when it comes down to it, uh, the lack of respect that was shown earlier to me tonight during the UCW Zero State of the Union address is just appalling. And quite frankly, I hope that Martin Casals gives him the beating that he has been needing. You know, I see it differently. I see Jace Jackson that he came out and he stood up for something. And the fact that Martin Casals is dissing the fans, disrespecting the people here, the faithful who pay their money to come see people like Jackson wrestle and be put in matches, that's about the best thing that you did tonight was give Jason Jackson a match. Well, you know what? Jackson has an opportunity. Hopefully he'll take the most... Uh, he'll make the most of it as it's going to be a test of strength. You know, Casals backs out of the test of strength between himself and Jason Jackson. See, and that's why I love Casals. The man is not afraid to take it to any of these fans. And that's why Casals will always have a home here at UCW as long as I am president. In the meantime, Jackson just waiting for his opportunity. And so far has taken advantage, but the athleticism by Martin Casals able to turn it around. Well, and you know, beautiful execution right there. You gotta give you gotta give Casals credit. As long as I've known this guy, he has always been athletic. In high school was the captain of both the football and the wrestling team, and he has made the most out of every opportunity he's ever been given. And you know what? That's something that Jason Jackson hasn't done. I'm giving him an opportunity here tonight to prove himself because he couldn't get the job done at incarceration. He had to have someone else do it for him. He was on the winning team. Every member of the team is important. And the fact that the brains behind it all, Jackson, very well in my eyes proved that he could stand up to anybody and tonight he'll prove to you again hey, and again let me tell you something Cody I know you haven't been in the industry very long and I'm not saying that I'm a veteran by any means but I have been in this business a lot longer than you and at the end of the day when the history books are written people remember the guy who got the pinfall they don't remember the team well now that it's in a single would, competition would you Jackson rather will... would you rather be Kobe Bryant or Robert Ory uh, would you rather be Tim Duncan or would you rather be like Manu Ginobili? Do you do you know basketball? I see your point. Yes. Would I, you rather be Hawk or Animal? Obviously Hawk. Well, that that answer could have gone either way. It really could have. Jason but. Jackson has some impressive moves, putting Casals in his own submission move that he did earlier. And now Casals, of course, going to use his size and height to his advantage. That's one thing about Jason Jackson. He's always been an underdog, and he's always been able to overcome the odds. I just don't think he'll do that tonight. But see, when he outsmarts Martin Casals like that, able to leapfrog over him and able to land a beautiful kick to the chin that's where he can outsmart that's where he can overcome the odds I see it happening tonight well now Casals to the outside getting a quick breather Jason Jackson going to go after him now and, and Casals just goes into the audience Jackson is going to go and serve up some punches right there in the front row. Jackson's got to be careful, make sure he doesn't get counted out. Oh, look at this. Beautiful execution. That's just smart in-ring IQ by Casals, able to reverse what was an attack from Jason Jackson and put Jason Jackson into the ropes and now take advantage of this match. He's just so dominant. He is an animal, and he is a bigger dog in this fight. He is, but we know Jackson has a pit bull, and he will is relentless on fighting. A mixed crowd reaction. Is there clearly some fans behind Casals, but not not enough to uh, gain the advantage? Beautiful execution right there as Jackson falls to the outside. Oh, 
Oh, look at Casaus, man. He's just so kids. he's so intimidating. He's so look at that. That dude bulges so much muscle. It's ridiculous. It is. I don't. How much body fat you think he has on him? I bet it's in oh, negative yeah. numbers. I'd agree. He's very in physical shape. You, 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 you clearly he, know nothing about physical fitness if you just agreed with me that he has negative body fat. I, you know what? Cody, are you a yes man? Is that why you were hired? No, absolutely not. It would be intimidating to see Mark Casals in an alley, especially with as crazy as he is. Oh, Casals is too classy to hang out in alleys, but he will put his opponent in a sleeper hold like he will right here. Put Jackson. He's going to put the pit bull to sleep, and that might be for the best. Well, we know Jason Jackson, and we know he's relentless. He'll fight out anything, as he is right now. You know, I'll tell you what, at one time, I really did think that Jason Jackson had all the potential in the world. Not even the sky would have been the limit for Jason Jackson. But as of recently, I just don't know what his, what his thought process has been, what he's been thinking. This kid is going to end his career super quick. And it's because of moves like that where Casals will take advantage and win this match right here in a little bit. That was only a two. That was only a two. That was only two. Getting a little ahead of yourself there, Josh. I'm excited. Do you blame me for being excited? It's an exciting atmosphere here tonight. It is. This UCW arena, the fans are pumped. Oh, look at this. Oh. Look at this. Oh. oh. You know, it's funny because normally the dog slobbers on the guy, but in this case, the guy slobbered on the dog. Isn't that funny? Ooh. I think it's, it's funny. It's disgusting. Yeah, it's, it's hilarious. It's. Look at this now. Casaus stomps in the midsection in the turnbuckle. Not something you see every day. Don't, Re don't mess with Noah. And yeah, Noah doesn't want any, any palms to the face either. We know where that palm has been. This sheep of an audience now cheering for the referee out of all people. This is why we don't let these people vote. Jackson just getting humbled in the corner. Chop after chop by Martin. There's the fighting spirit that J Jackson has. Oh, and look at this now. Jackson looking for a comeback. Casal says, nope, here's a suplex. Very well executed by Casals, who has been dominating this match from the, from the moment that the bell rang. He has been dominant. What has Casals got here now? Casals gonna put him back in that sleeper again. Try to get him to pass out here. Casals can go home happy. These fans can go home happy. Just wrenching on that neck, tightening that headlock. Jackson is showing some life. Very slowly losing circulation, blood circulation, losing oxygen to the brain. You could just see how red uh, Jason Jackson's face in, cutting that circulation off. <laughs> Big body slam right there. Look at this now, Casaus picking up Jackson, going for a suplex or a second body, a second body slam. Uh-oh. And now Casaus addressing the fans here. He's going to go to the second rope. Look at this. I don't see that very wise. Cheer for your idol, ladies and gentlemen. As they cheer, Jackson again, time to do a little bit of breather. But what's oh Martin goodness. doing? Top rope. Wait a minute, what is this? No way! Out of desperation, Jackson. <laughs> now here's the opportunity to where Jackson can capitalize if he can make it to his feet. I say he doesn't have enough in him, man. There's just not enough there. Casaus, on the other hand, he thrives off this crazy factor of his, and he's going to take it out on Jackson. 
this crazy factor could hurt him as well, beating his head against Matt. I mean, what person does that? No, man. I mean, this dude This dude was a football player back in the day, a wrestler most of his life, man. He thrives on this stuff. Jab for jab. Big blow by each man, but Martin oh, look at that. getting the upper hand. Oh, it's that big knee, man. Oh, man. There's a big foot by Jason Jackson. And look at this. Casals, he's going to go for that TKO. Nobody home there. Wait a minute. There's Jason Jackson capitalizing and gets a one, two, three. Is that proof enough, Josh? And your winner, Jackson! Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Cut the music. Absolutely not at all, not now. Noah, I am getting sick and tired of your bull crap as an official. Now these people may about? not have a voice, but that was clear as night and day that Martin Casals kicked out before the three count. That was very clear to me. And the best part is, is that I saw it. This match will restart. What is this? President Josh Damien turning over the match because he believed that Martin Casals kicked out before a three count? How much does Jason Jackson have to prove to President Josh Damien? Jackson now climbing to the top rope. Oh, and Martin shoving the referee into the... Oh, and what's this? Martin shoving the referee into the ropes. Jason Jackson taking a low blow. Oh no, here we go. A suplex. Martin trying to do a suplex from the second rope. But Jason Jackson fighting out of it. to Martin Casals. The fans here believe in Martin, in Jason Jackson, but Martin Casals catching him. Oh, what a shot by Martin. No, not this way. 